What's up guys? Quick video on showing you how to make your own banks in Beatmaker 3 using other apps. So I'm going to open up the sampler in Beatmaker 3. Then I'm going to go into plugin, enter app audio, and I'm going to go down to Beathawk. Now you could do this with any app, but I'm just going to do Beathawk right now. I'm going to go into Beathawk and choose the bank I want. Then back to Beatmaker 3. I'm going to go to the record button and make sure my input is on Beathawk. Then I'm going to hit start, go back to Beathawk, and play my pads one at a time. Once you're done, go back to Beatmaker 3, push stop, and your sounds are there. Now I'm going to go to slice mode, auto slice, and detect. Now usually 100% works fine, but if it doesn't and you see it's a little bit off, you can try going back into it and bringing your detect down to 50 and you see it's perfect. Or just make the edits yourself. Then I'm going to go to save, save to pads, apply, and here they are. You can use this for anything, add effects to it, change them up, or just keep them the way they are, play with the roll. Now to save, you just go save bank, copy samples, name it what you want, save. To load your bank, you just go to bank, search for the name you gave it, load it up, and there they are. Now a cool trick. You could just go to keys on the sound you want and change them up and play around. Hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe. Check out WeSampleEverything.com for more tutorials, beats, sample packs, and our new producer forum. Peace.